1400 meters. Not the last, they sent on their way from that 1400 meter marker. Hey, Judas at the back early on. One of the first out is Royal Chariot. That makes the early running. Lilibet with the cheek pieces is right there. Believe the best. The red sleeves and cap is trying to overcome that draw. Liberty Print is near the rail. T totals between the two of them. Then comes Purple Sky. Purple Sky races about five or six lengths off the leader. Going around them now on the outside is Amber First to be amongst the leading group. Then we drop back to three ships. Three ships and Amber Bell. They're about six or seven lengths off the leader at this stage. They're about to swing into that home stretch. They're followed further back in the field by Holy Flame and Roy's Novel is along the inside as they swing into the home stretch then comes frame of mind that's got about seven or eight lengths to make up as they turn for home royal chariot is the leader royal chariot liberty print lily bird teetotals on the inside purple sky holy flame down the inside frame of mind believe the best gets hooked right out with the red sleeves and cap and hey judas running on from nowhere coming to the 200 roy's novice down on the inside of that one as frame of mind and Believe the best starts to warm up now. And yes, believe the best coming on well. And believe the best will win it. Second place is going to go to Roy's novice, Lily Bird. And then came Frame of Mind. Number 13, Believe the Best is victorious. And a pickup ride from Anne Mahudla, who rode a very nice race from that wide draw. And believe the best, the Oratorio for Glenn Carson, Trigor Stud, and for Highlands Farm Stud, who bred. Wins at number 13, tote favourite, 360. Second goes to number 4, Roy's Novice, 220 the place. Number 3, Lily Bert, 250 the place, runs into third. Fourth to number 10, Frame of Mind at 330. Take note of the run of Hey Jude, it came from Stone Last, was a little bit slow into stride and was staying on nicely at the business end. Holy Flame is further back and then came Amber first, teetotal, three ships and further back in the run, Per Monkey. We'll take a look at that head on shortly and the winner is on the extreme right hand side, Believe the Best. It's only second time at the track and comes on Goodyear, Believe the Best and uh, hits the front and then goes on to score a nice victory in the ninth and last. So your tote favourite is home. That quartet pool was on the 440,000 or a little bit higher. That's all for the time being. Back to the studio. About to return to the winner's enclosure, number 13, Believe the Best, Oratorio, bred by Highlands Farm Stud, Kriegel Stud, and Mahula picked up the ride, and it's for Glenn Carson, went off toad favourite, 360.
for the Kriegel stud, the Hattings, believe the best, the Oratorio. Well done to the Kriegel stud. Yes, man. Uh, I'd like to say good luck to the uh, Kriegel stud, uh, to say good luck to Glenn Kutzin, to Mr. Hugo, uh, to Kathy, you know, and uh, to Atandiwe, because, uh, you know, Jockey change, things change. Hey, man, what can I say? During the week, you said this is the business. You told the guys, lock on the last one. Yeah, she's, she's a very nice fit. I think last time she was just unlucky. When she came up to the gate, she got bumped. And uh, yeah, she's a very, very decent fit. We're expecting this very run great one, you know. I like the stop of the straight. Atendiwe said we're not going to get into trouble. He brought her to the extreme outside. Exactly, like he said, uh, he, he felt this was in top of 600. He said, no, he's already won the race. And then that's why he switched him the outside, you know. Got a little bit of a cut behind there, but nothing too serious? Yeah, I did saw that. Uh, he said, to whatever horse was behind him, that's the horse he cut him there. Yeah. So it's a victory full of merit. Yes, I'll call my main doctor tomorrow, Manfred, to come and have a look and uh, take it from there. Well, let's believe the best and all the best. Thank you very much. I'd like to say good luck to attend you. And uh, it was a really hot day for me in the office today. <laughs> <laughs> there we have it. Lunga, hot day in the office. We now got Atendiwe coming through in those silks. And you had the draw, you committed a round, and you were happy where you were. Yes, I had to commit a round. You know, um, she came in the race with uh, solid form and, you know, uh, got caught three deep, but she was quite comfortable where she was. And uh, she's one more. Well done. Good end to the meeting. Yes, uh, thank you very much, Sheldon. Um, just a big thank you to Lunga, to Mr. Kotzen and the owners. Much appreciate the chance. Well done. Thank you. And lucky for some, lucky for some. Like I said, we're not superstitious. Number 13, believe the best. That's the winner of the end of the day. Good days racing, safe trip home, and we'll catch you on Wednesday, Zane. We'll catch you at the races.